Hey, welcome back to No Hype Beer Review. Really excited for today's beer, especially after yesterday's, which was another barrier beer. Uh, both were IPAs. That one was a collaboration. Uh, you should watch that video. But uh, that one was a collaboration with Barrier. They brewed it. And then uh, Carton, Interboro, and other half. And then uh, each of those other companies did a little twist on it, almost like making a variant, uh, adding uh, wheat, adding oats, and adding lactose. Um, this one is actually just a collaboration with other half. This one, though, I didn't look up if it's a proper collaboration where they came up with a recipe together. They're doing something similar where uh, Barrier did this base beer and then uh, other half's going to do something different. Um, anyways, 7.4% uh, ABV. This one, this can does not give a lot of information. Um, again, the one that where it was a four uh, brewery collaboration that had like it was double dry hop, the hops in it. This one, yeah, it just says, like, oh, if you can see that or not. Anyway, brewed with other half. Pretty cool can art. Um, yeah, it's, it's an IPA. Has the date on the bottom. Uh, about three weeks old. So, yeah, really excited to uh, get into this. I really liked the one I did yesterday. And I've liked uh, what I've had from them so far. Um, so, yeah, really excited we get their stuff here. Pretty cool to, like, go to the store and pick up um other half you know even you know it's a collab and uh so yeah glad beer gets distributed here wow almost four fingers ahead nice yellow sunshiny um kind of like gold not quite honey colored it definitely looks nice bubbles are, are breaking up pretty quickly um fairly compact uh, off white head but uh, yeah definitely looks good into Roma. Nothing's jumping out at me. The other one, that was definitely more aromatic. I'm going to say the two side by side. I don't know why I didn't, but anyway. Uh, that one, the, the aromatics was definitely stronger, hitting the face more. This one's more muted. It's sweet. I'm getting citrus. A little bit like sweet lemon, like I got on the other one. Man, it's tough. A little tropical. Yeah, the nose is, is bottom half. And the nose is not super impressive. Um, but this happened maybe like a week ago. I did a Collective Arts New England style IPA. And that nose was nothing to write home about. But the taste of that beer was amazing. And so I'm hopeful for this because this nose is just not screaming anything. Yeah, it's pretty generic sweet fruit. Looks the part, smells, eh. Let's hope the taste is really good. Cheers. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Great level of bitterness. I get that lemon in here too. It's like a mix, real lemon, and then like a, a lemon head or some sort of lemon candy. I don't get grapefruit, but I get the peel and the very finish. Well, okay, a little bit of pink grapefruit in the finish as I'm talking. But definitely, I'm going to say it's more lemon forward in the actual taste. A little bit of green tea. Like an herbal quality, which lends itself to a little bit of a floral note, which I haven't gotten a lot lately in what I've been drinking. Yeah, definitely a drier, more bitter beer. Juice heads do not want this beer. Uh, it is not one of those at all. Goes down real easy. Wow. Super easy. Now I'm getting a slight berry note. Like a little bit of strawberry, almost not quite bubble gum, but a little bit of that in there. It's good. It's it's a good beer. The bet was way better. Um, if you have access to this, buy it. Like it, it does, it tastes good. Like bitter IPAs, it tastes good. It's just not as good as uh, I went in the wrong order apparently because that bet I had yesterday was way better than this. Um, but yeah, still a good beer just because they brewed one that I liked a lot more. 
doesn't make this bad, but that one's better. Um, they continue to impress me. Whatever number offering this is for me, for them, good stuff. Uh, if you haven't checked me out on Instagram, on tap, there's just no hype beer reviews at both those places. So always please like, comment, subscribe, and most importantly, imbibe. Cheers, everyone.